Did you know that your anxiety could manifest itself as your heart racing a million miles an hour? This video will show how the racing heart is related to anxiety. I will explain to you the whole process behind the tachycardia. In the end, I will also share with you how you can treat tachycardia naturally. Welcome to another episode of Live Without Anxiety, the channel where you can find the best anxiety hacks. In this video, you will discover what tachycardia is. How do you know that you have tachycardia when you have a panic attack. When should you worry about your heart rate? Is there any hope to calm this thumping heart movement? Hang on to the end of the video. I will be sharing all the necessary details step by step. First things first. Racing heart, as the name suggests, is a condition where your heart beats so fast that you feel like it is jumping out of your body. This condition is called tachycardia in medical terminology. To be more precise, tachycardia means that your heart beats more than 100 times per minute. The usual healthy range of a heart rate is 60 to 100 beats per minute. So if it's more than 100, which usually goes between 100 and 140 beats per minute, it is tachycardia. Now, the question is, when should you get worried about your increased heart rate? It's essential to understand that there may be two reasons for tachycardia. First is the case when you may have a heart problem. That's the reason most people have the first instinct of tachycardia as a heart attack. In this case, you need medications to cope with it. Secondly, there could be a situation where your body demands a rapid heart rate, although there is no problem with your heart. This is what exactly happens in anxiety. Due to stress hormones, the need for blood to other body regions increases and the heart pumps faster to meet the body requirements. So you feel rapid palpitations. Now you know what does tachycardia mean and what is the relationship between rapid heart rate and anxiety. Next, I'm going to share with you the natural ways by which you can treat tachycardia. Make sure you understand this video till the last minute so you will save yourself from the adverse effects of medications as much possible. The first thing I want to mention is to get your medical checkup. Once the doctor has confirmed that there is no problem with your heart, you can focus on getting rid of tachycardia due to anxiety. I don't recommend medications or pills for tachycardia as long as there is no severe heart disease. I understand that I can't replace a doctor's expert opinion if he suggests you beta blockers or cardiac ablation procedure, where they use an energy beam to destroy a little part of your heart that generates excessive electricity impulses. But what I'm trying to say is that the best way to deal with racing heart as a symptom of anxiety is to bring the following two major lifestyle modifications. The first one is to try several relaxation techniques including meditation, yoga and exercise to bring your heartbeat to be normal. When you have a fluttering feeling in the chest like your heart has skipped a beat, deep breathing is the best way to lower your heart rate. What I usually do is that I close my mouth and nose and build up pressure in my chest, like I'm stifling a sneeze. Then I breathe in for 5 to 8 seconds, hold that breath slowly for 3 to 5 seconds and finally exhale calmly. By repeating this process several times, I raise my aortic pressure to normalize my heart rate. The second way is to bring about changes in what you eat and boost your healthy diet habits. Foods, which are an excellent source of sodium, potassium and calcium, can help your heart pacemakers not to get overexcited. Eating bananas, potatoes, spinach or other leafy green vegetables can be helpful. Also, take care of what you drink. Please don't go for cold drinks since they are too acidic and excite heart impulses. Drink fresh water to keep your body hydrated. You need to avoid excessive alcohol use as well. Alright, that was it. The complete explanation of tachycardia, also known as a racing heart in anxiety. It refers to a heart rate more than 100 beats per minute. It is one of the common symptoms of anxiety. Most of the time it settles on its own as your panic attack ends. But the home remedies that can help you to stop these fast palpitations are to take deep breaths and eat healthy things. Let me know in your comments down below if you have any other symptoms of tachycardia and what do you do to normalize it. Meanwhile, please do subscribe to my channel and hit the notifications bell to receive the new video updates of proven anxiety hacks and begin your journey towards living without anxiety. If you found this video helpful, do share it with your friends. Since you like this video, I'm sure you would love to know about anxiety and chest pain. Why do we feel chest pain when we have anxiety? The video is right here. Make sure you check it out and remember, you can live without anxiety.